So hello everyone, um, so this is gonna be my first solo video, I'm not used to this sort of thing, I'm not even sure what my own voice sounds like, so you can tell, but um, I just wanted to try this out, and I started off with a discussion that I thought about in my head for a while, and I just kind of want to muse about, um, so yeah, here we go. So my big discussion is, should Doctor Who be rebooted? Now, I know what you guys are thinking. Doctor Who's already been rebooted. Technically, no. Doctor Who has only been relaunched. Or, I guess, revitalized. Eh, I would say a little bit of both. I mean, yeah. It's still a continuation of the original story. So, you know... <laughs> but the thing is, Doctor Who has, like, 50 years now worth of continuity building up for it. We have... It's like just the origins of all the species, like we have companions that from 30 years ago popping up, what we did in the Davies run, Moffat era, kind of doing its own thing, and that's cool, I guess. Um, and then you, of course, you know, have the big finish stuff, the comics, etc., etc., what have you. I, and I was just thinking just recently that, okay, I got this idea after I was watching the geek evolution, uh, Marvel Ultimate stuff. And I just thought, what if Doctor Who had that? Like, what if Doctor Who had its own Ultimates edition, I guess? It's Ultimates, right? Yeah. Yeah, it is Ultimates. Um, I'm not a comic book person, as you can clearly tell already. Um... Oh, this is hard. Yeah, this video is going to be just me rambling and just long, silent pauses. But anyway, the idea is basically, what if Doctor Who got a reboot? And I mean a full-on reboot. We start with year one, basically, all over again. We start with the first Doctor. I also mentioned this earlier in another podcast as well. And to the person I mentioned it to, he said that he would actually find that interesting and actually might start watching Doctor Who because it rebooted and you get started all over again. And, you know, that just keeps getting me thinking, like, how would they do it? I've always been curious about that. Like, I'm not sure if this is something I want to see happen, but I definitely would find it rather interesting if it did happen. Like, I want to see it and I don't want to see it. That's so weird. Um, yeah, I'm nervous right now, as you can clearly tell. Um, because I'm just so invested in current Doctor Who stuff. But it's also, I agree, it's, it's convoluted all heck, and the continuity definitely... I don't want to say the continuity dragged it down, necessarily. Like, you can get away with ignoring a lot of Doctor Who continuity and be fine. Just so long as you know, remember the important stuff. Like, if you remember stuff like Genesis of the Daleks, or, uh, or who all the Doctors are, maybe a companion in the past here and there. Like, you can get away with ignoring certain stories, and, you know, none of that ever coming back to haunt, him, haunt you. You know, I know some people want to see the return of Sutek, but that's a different case. Um... But I would so like to see almost streamlined histories of things such as the Daleks, the Cybermen, maybe the Time Lords. Like, if I were to reboot Doctor Who, I would definitely want to... Maybe I wouldn't? I definitely would like to at least... Tr well, maybe this is just me. I would definitely like to at least try and say these are where the different factions come from. Because I've always been a big believer in the idea that Gallifrey, Scarrow, wherever Suntar and Homeworld is, I'm sure someone out there will tell you what it is, are in different time zones. I know the Daleks are in the future. I know that just from listening to Big Finish. Oh yeah, that's another thing. Big, big Finish fan. And that definitely had its own weird, but yet better than the show, ironically, continuity. Uh, at least it tries to build a cohesive universe. And that's another thing I would like to see from Doctor Who, if you rebooted it. Try and build a more cohesive universe. I mean, obviously Doctor Who isn't Star Wars or Star Trek. It's Doctor Who, it's just, it's supposed to be cheesy, but in a good, fun way. But I still would love to see a more cohesive universe. Like, certain historical events take place in certain time periods. Apart from, of course, Earth's historical time period. Um, 
Let's see. Yeah, that is just something that popped into my head. Rebooting Doctor Who. Like, I know people already would hate that idea just on principle. Reboots are like the most... You say reboot and already guns flaring, guns fired, shots fired. I mean, it happened a little bit with Star Wars. It happened a little bit with Star Trek. Um, happened with Marvel and DC every ten years. Um, although that is interesting because Doctor Who definitely had a comic book feel to it just in terms of... I've always said this, Doctor Who is like a comic book on, TV, on a TV show. The TV comic book show. In fact, it has that feeling because, you know, different showrunners, villains always come back from the dead. Is they you wipe out the Daleks and then five episodes later they're back. So it definitely had a TV vibe. I mean, a comic book vibe to it. Well, I'm sure this video is going to get so many dislikes. Um, but yeah, that is something that just really... And I don't know... You know, if you were to do this, I would honestly first you test it out like on a comic book. Like, do a Doctor Who Ultimate comic book. Ultimates thing. It's, it's all... No, I, may, I might be mixing this up. No, it has to be Ultimates, because that's Marvel, right? Marvel has the Ultimates thing. In fact, I would love to see Year One Doc... No, not Year One. Earth One Doctor Who. My bad. Earth One Doctor Who. Like, and I know there are things like that out there. Big Finish has, like, a few alternate Doctors, like, where originally they got a guy to replace... No, the idea was... John Pertree's Doctor, Rez, third Doctor, regenerate into somebody else who wasn't Tom Baker? And they're doing like an Earth 1 other universe kind of thing? Because Doctor Who has other universes. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. So, maybe you could do that, where you just like, you just show another universe, and you can say like, do a Star Trek thing, where you have like, prime continuity Doctor Who, where it's your traditional Doctor Who, and then you have this alternate Doctor Who take. You start all over with a new first Doctor. I almost would, and something I would love to do if they did that is like have like a cohesive arc for the the Doctor Who's entire life cycle. Maybe I don't know if that'd be difficult because if we still keep some of the original rules, then you would have at least eleven to. No, 13 regenerations. Is it 13? Yeah, it's 13. Um, but now it also, like, really delve into his path. Like, he can set up the master, obviously. A new take on the master. Maybe just go on... You can just... Maybe you should just enact the, the heart and the master plan. Which, for non hoovians is basically the idea. Is the master is the doctor's brother. And the doctor is, like, the other. Which is, like, some sort of spiritual god thing. Um, that sort of idea... I would. I don't know what you would do with the Daleks necessarily. How you would change them up? I mean, maybe you just go more in depth in terms of Scarrow's backstory. Maybe you have Davros be the leader throughout most of the Daleks. I mean, maybe that's what you do. You you keep Davros. You put him in charge for once in his life. Like he is the head Dalek. He's the emperor. He's the emperor from the start. You don't have this weird. Oh, no, sometimes he's the Emperor, sometimes it's the Supreme Dalek, sometimes it's the Emperor Dalek. Streetline, who's in charge of the Daleks? Why don't you? Um, Cybermen, you don't really change Cybermen that up too much, I guess. Maybe you can, like, have it, like, be some sort of a... No, then you run out of things to do with Earth. Or you can just connect the Cybermen to Earth, and then you'd have the Cyber Uprising, I don't know. Uh, I should do an entire video when I have more to think about how you would reboot and change everything. If anybody in the comments, if any of you people listening want to tell me how I re you would reboot Doctor Who, let me know. Um, clearly, maybe give Gallifrey even more mythology than it already kind of has. That's the thing, Doctor Who doesn't have mythology. A mythology. I mean, it does and it doesn't. Some things are more mythological than others, I guess. Like, Gallifrey clearly has its own lore a little bit. Granted, that's more from the big finish, but even then it has its own little design. You have Daleks, obviously, they're the big bads. Um, I'm just repeating myself now, aren't I? Um, but yeah, I would... I don't know, do you people want to see Doctor Who? I don't think people want to see Doctor Who get a full-on reboot. Although I do know that was originally the plan before the 2005 show came back, is that they were going to reboot it, but they didn't. Which I'm fine with. I like, I'm, I'm glad Doctor Who's still going strong 30 years, because it's 50 years worth of continuity. Although, granted, you know, 
It's Doctor Who. We don't have continuity. Doctor Who doesn't have continuity. <laughs> okay, we do, but... It's a weird situation. Some people treat it better than others. <coughs> yeah, big finished. Um, what's that? Ooh, wink. Yeah, ooh, that's gonna be weird. But yeah, I'm just saying but yeah a lot. So I apologize, this is my first solo video and I didn't know what to say. But this is just something I, I thought about. I don't know how much I would change the designs of things. Maybe make the Dalek mutant scarier? I don't know, I love Davros's classic design, so I, I don't know if I would change it that much. Maybe you show Davros? Maybe, you, nah, you wouldn't show Davros. Davros needs to be still half Dalek. I'm thinking about showing him his full human first. Uh, maybe that's how you do it. Maybe that's how you introduce the Daleks. You just show Genesis the Daleks, and that's their origin. The Doctor, and, they, and they're set in the future. Or maybe everything should be set in the future, like Gallifrey, Scar, they're all in the same time period. That would make things a little easier in terms of figuring out the time war. So yeah, that's that's my uh, ramblings of if you want to reboot Doctor Who, tell me if you can hear this video, tell me if you like this video, and tell me if I should do more of this. This is like in the 11 minutes, so yeah, my first solo video, probably not that good. But I wanted to bring this out anyway. Okay, see ya folks. Subscribe to the Imperial Hollow Knight podcast, and till next time.